Uh, well, hi. So if you're watching this video, then it means you are getting into any of these digital marketing courses. The first one is the course for Google to become a PPC executive. The second one is the course for Meta to become Meta Ads executive. And through these courses, we are trying, trying to deploy different campaigns for this project. Now, this project is a jewelry based e-commerce store. And people who are learning digital marketing have to understand that you need to have a website, you need to have a project to learn digital marketing. Because it's not only about deploying the campaigns, you also have to analyze the results from these campaigns. So the journey is being started with learning the plannings of the project, which means how do you plan a project, then how do you plan keywords for the project, and then finally how you can create the media plan. So people who are having or looking at this sheet will be having these topics in the lecture column. So you have to go through the lecture of each and every topic. And after listening to the lecture, you have to complete the exercises, which means you have to create the project plan for any project by yourself, maybe for one or for multiple projects. But majorly, the activities or the campaigns will be happening for this website, which is Springtails. Then let's say if you are making campaigns like search campaign or listening the topic for the search campaign, uh, then you have to do exercises, which means you have to create the search campaign by yourself with any daily budget. You have to make three groups in the search campaign and subsequently you have to add display campaign along with the search campaign. So every topic is being created in a way where you also do the practical exercises. Now, if it's about only learning uh, digital marketing and i guess there's no point in going through the sheet going through this training the training is made for people who are looking forward to do the practical exercises without practical exercises you can't really become a ppc executive now also after watching each and every lecture after going through each and every module you also are required or expected to mark your progress so let's say if rajesh is uh, added to this sheet who joined this training a couple of days ago, he can see his name in any of these columns and then he has to mark his progress in each of the rows, which could be start, which could start with pending, then in progress, then completed, and then if he's getting any issues. Issues can be marked over here. So if you have joined this course today, then your name is also gonna appear in the training exercises status. This is about Google. You can also go through the profiles and salaries for digital platforms, for digital roles in uh, digital marketing. So you can decide which role or which profile you have to choose. If you go with PPC executive, social media, SEO, and then you also can see the estimated salaries in the market for people who are having experience of one year, maybe three year or four year, depending on how much experience person can get. Then you get to see the options of getting a job in digital marketing, followed to which we have options of getting a project in digital marketing, terms in digital marketing, and you have different subsheets within each of the training courses. Then you can get to the uh, meta ads training sheet, which is gonna have the same kind of options, campaign types, project properties, meta ad targeting, Facebook ad formatting. So you will be having different subsheets in this course as well. And eventually you are required to mark your progress in the training exercises status sheets. So I guess now you can start your journey. It's highly needed that you create the exercises, which means you create the campaigns and also you can see the performance of these campaign. So I have already shown you the performance through different uh, campaigns. Let's say if I talk about Meta, which is going to be happening in a Facebook ad accounts. Let's say if I open up the Springtails account for you, then this account is gonna have different campaigns. We'll be having some active campaigns, we'll be having some paused campaigns, and you are required to go through the performance of these campaigns. So performance means you need to see how much, uh, let's say if you run a sales campaign, you should be seeing how much sales the campaign is generating and what is the cost per sale. If you run traffic campaign, then you should be able to gauge the landing page views from the traffic campaign. If you are running page like campaign, you should be able to see how many page likes campaign has generated for you and how much is the cost per like. 
if you don't get to know the results of these campaigns you really don't learn digital marketing so digital marketing is more about the returns more about the performance every video is going to have the information through which you can go through the campaign performance and also campaign results in the end as i said you can mark your progress in the training sheet and then i shall be seeing you inside the course